Greetings everyone, this is BJ Black from No Export For You and welcome to part 116 of my Let's Play of Ama UA Castle Meister. Now I've mentioned this, so I don't know, in part 95 or whatever. It's a scene that's basically a repeat of a scene we've already seen. Hey, that... That's a homophone, isn't it? Anyway, I'm just going to skip through this because... Oops, wrong button. This button. Hi everyone. Everybody there? Okay, bye. Although it's kind of funny that I was just passing over it over and over again and never paid any attention to it beyond the first time. Well, funny for me anyway. So, this is what we're here to do. Okay, so wow. The blue color here is shiny and pretty. It's really fantastic for a cave and all. I was thinking that because it was hidden behind some mechanisms, the more we look at it, um, it seems like nobody's been here in quite some time. Hey, maybe there are some treasures hiding around down here. I was getting excited. So, Avaro was saying, was talking about how he thinks this cave is wonderful, but he was just talking about how it was pretty. Ah, oh, yes, of course. It is so very pretty down here. <laughs> yeah, nice save, Avaro. Yes, you can say. Oh, yes, I have a request in. So I better get this done before I forget it. Grow up, Katarito. <laughs> Things that make sense in context. Maybe deploying Katarito in that particular space is not a good idea. Okay. The enemies around here are typically level 35. And the enemies in this particular map are really, really freaking tough. Shutsugeki! So let's deploy a couple of Yuiki. Rurin is going to be useful here. For reasons which I'm not going to tell you until later. Actually, Fia, you can stay out. We're going to need all the healing we can get. So, that should handle us. Hmm. I think this is an empty room. Great. So, in addition to this... Okay, in addition to this cave being pretty and all. Also in this cave are a bunch of very tough and very obnoxious enemies. Don't be surprised if you hear me swearing at them from time to time. They deserve it, believe you me. For the moment, this is going to work. Hmm. You know, maybe I shouldn't have deployed the Yuiki right away. It's going to be pretty cramped in here. Okay, yeah, that'll work. I feel like I'm forgetting someone or something. Ah, oh, yes. It's a fairly big map and there are a lot of places I need engineers at, so I'm going to deploy Detail as well. That'll cover us for now. Oh, 
行動開始だ Okay, full mill equipped, so we get lots of drops. Hmm, a rainbow pearl. How nice. Well, two of them, actually. Let's see. I can march cutting out there and start killing stuff. No, not yet. First, I want to equip his skills. Determination is, of course, a good thing. But I also want a big smashing skill. Now these particular bugs are one of the really annoying enemies we'll fight here. Hey, level up. Mm, it's alright as far as level ups go. Something annoying about them is they have a long range ice attack which can chew eye up, really. Fortunately they won't use it very much if they have a better target right in front of them. Hmm, probably a bad idea. But I got a request for Teenage Katorito's battle animation, so let's see it. It's interesting how her wings stick out of her dress there. I guess something was necessary. She stands on the toes of her geta there. That's really cute. Alright, thanks Katorito. You've done your job. Oh yeah, this guy. I hate these goat head <laughs> angels so much. Well, they're archangels, actually. I hate these bastards so much. <laughs> Bam! Yeah, don't mess with Karin. It's an angel hammer. What? I don't make them up. Yay, capture for us. And that's enough animations, thanks. Oh yeah, those girls give tons of experience. Uh, Nope, that's too much damage. Three, thirty-four. Too much damage as well. Now it'd be nice if I could march. Of our up front because he has a really powerful earth attack that can also capture, but he's weak against ice. I might make use of um, Deedhelm's longer ranged attacks. Yeah, so I think that would be best. Hmm. Now that that Archangel's on the move, I don't want him getting anywhere close to my ghosts. Although he is low on life, the ghosts could probably counterattack his ass back to the Stone Age. Hmm, anyway. Yeah. 
I still need another one of those shields. Because Mikeu has an awesome magic attack. Hmm. Nah, I'll just hide here for a minute. Oh, wait, I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, that's what I meant by it. They chew eye up. Man, that hurt. Okay, heal eye. Probably we'll be okay now. Oh, yes, of course, the ghosts. And even Karun can't even touch them. <laughs> okay, whatever. It's not like it can hurt. She can hurt him either. Stupid goat bastards. Much like they were back in the... Fortress of Angels. Ha! Suck on it, bug thing. Those Archangels will just hang back and throw range attacks until they're practically out of SP sometimes. Hmm. Three times 24. Too much. Now, Karin's determination is kicking in. Hmm, what needs to happen next is... The ghosts over there need to come into this room. Ha. Huh. Let's downgrade this skill to the weaker form of smashing. Let's see if we can not kill it with this. Oh, Jesus. That was... Uh, okay. So I guess we'll just cherry tap it to death then. Is that okay with everyone? Good. Fine. No, not now. No, not now. <laughs> and healing him would actually be counterproductive, so nothing for her to do either. Goat bastards. Hey, defense, defense, speed. You know, if you ask me, every time I'll go for... Attack, rather than defense. Okay, attacks. Hmm, well, it appears he's got enough to tackle there. Physical attack, at least. This is a bad idea. There are like three of those ghosts on that side. And they have a powerful magic attack, so... I'm going to have Avaro take this one. 
Cotton will take the other one. Because he can tank a whole bunch of pissed off ghosts. Oh, hey, look at that. This is really convenient. Hmm, I didn't use him much in my trial run because he was high enough level already. But he is pretty close to ideal for taking on these bug bastards. I'm still too terrified to let my ghosts come out. Although, strictly speaking, he could have walked right up to I and smacked her in the face a couple turns ago. Well, for the past three turns, I think. But still. I hate these ghost ba goat bastards. Get. The bastard's that annoying and he gives us like three experience points. I think I'm gonna just murder something until it's dead here. No surprise, there are ghosts behind the black. <laughs> yeah, nothing to see here. Move along. Hmm. I could swear... Oh yes, it has a ranged attack, but it's running itself out of SP already. Meaning next turn it's going to come in range of my good attacks. But for now, let's just take a pot shot at it. Probably gives good experience for, you know, otherwise being useless. Yeah, that was a lot. Hmm. The next task for Karin is to disappear. The next person I actually want to deploy is Rurin. Conveniently immune to bubbles. Oh yes, this is a new trap you haven't seen before. They are vines. You can get out of them with flight or uh, water breathing, submersible. But otherwise it'll take five hit points and make your guys confused, meaning you can't use any of your skills. Okay, he'll be good right there. Damn it. Oh, anything but that. It's like they're deliberately trying to fuck with me here. Yeah, none of my melee characters can do any damage to these girls. So I have to rely on my spellcasters. Which means run like hell, Avaro. <laughs> uh, great. Actually, Detail is really close to being able to do damage. Hey, he has anti air, doesn't he? Okay, so he could do, oh, 10 or 20 damage to him meaningful and he's resistant to darkness maybe I should have used him in my trial run 
Uh, no holy attacks, however. Not much to see here. I still feel like there are better uses. And oh geez, does she need healing. Will hear. Oh, a revive item thing. All right, from here, she can counterattack if this does a range attack, and this game can't get to her. So this will be good. Ah, naturally. This is workable. This works. More Gee, they're being surprisingly cooperative. When I was fighting those guys in my trial run, they'd be like, Dodge, haha, dodge, haha. Bam! So that kicks out the bugs, so I don't need to worry about any more of those. Although they're pretty high level characters. Were they four stars? If you want more of those for your... for your Yuiki and ghosts, then by all means leave that open and you can get like six or seven out of that thing. No, stay away. I don't want to play with you. Alright, shoot, Dean Helm. Shoot like your life depends on it. Yeah. Well, there's not much surprise to that, actually. If you take a look at Mikeu here, she's got her physical defense and her magic attack capped already. I mean, geez, what's the point of even letting these people try to level up if you're just going to put stack Fs that everyone hits anyway? Thanks, Ramen. Oh, look, an empty room. You know what happens in empty rooms. Hmm. I shouldn't have detail down here. Well, I would like to get around having him down here, but... Well, not much we can do about it. He was running away from that ghost. You see, detail me scared of ghosts. You knew that, right? Right. Hmm. 
Okay, this is a command. Attack Mikayu. Hey, look, an empty room that's actually empty. Or maybe rude and is just useless. Good enough, I'll take it. Now, detail needs to come up this way. Preferably with Mikayu backing him up, but... Ouch. I mean it. This is going to hurt. But, Fia will win. Well, magic defense is important when you're surrounded by... Fucking bat ghosts. No, oh, maybe I should show their animations. I mean, it's nothing special. We've seen ghosts that look a lot similar to them. Oh, wait. Ruin was just useless. There's tons of stuff to be found in here. Um. You know I'm used to these cards in the previous games also randomly teleporting you around the screen. I've never seen one do that in this game. It's kind of a pity because that was one of the really hilarious things it could do. Hmm. Almost there. Keep exploring, eh? Oh my god, a dragon. Huh, actually gonna attack me, is it? Well, it's an earth attack, so it can do some damage. Ouch. Did she already get hurt by something? This is just... Well, anyway, she'll be safe next turn. Fortunately, I know what I'm doing. Hmm. Detom's not a good choice for tackling that dragon. At least not at any kind of close range. Leaving my other characters. Well, let's deploy Karin. Because I know it's over there and it's really, really annoying. Ah, safety. And a goddess card, which healed her up to full. Normally I don't expect such good luck. Oh, look, a ghost. Oh, yeah, battle animations. Ah, yeah, yeah. It charmed him. That damn ghost charmed him. Now he's going to be a sitting duck for the next five turns or whatever. <sighs> well, this is still going way better than my trial run. I mean, I was getting charmed all over the place. I was getting bat dodged all over the place. It was ridiculous. Yeah. Okay, whatever, Fia. Just pretend like you're useful. Now Mikayu is here, because this thing spits out those ghost girls. And it's going to make its way generally in the direction of Fia in order to kill her. Okay, maybe not exactly Fia, but... 
it's going to be up to no good, and I want Mikio to catch it if it comes through this path. So, stand there. Oh, did I say if it comes through that path? I meant win. You had better not charm Ruben. Not a, not a. Oh, look. Karin is still charmed. Hmm. And Rurin is not charmed. That's good news. Now it's time to switch Detail him over to his lightning bow and start taking pot shots at this guy until he decides he doesn't want to hide in a corner anymore. Ah ha ha. You know, it's kind of rare for it to be so useful. Did that thing just stand there last turn? It just stood there last turn. How am I supposed to kill it? Huh. Hmm. 34 times 3. Too much damage, Kavin. Tone it back. Or at least get them to stop with the ranged attacks. Oh, I heard that. That dragon is on the move. Almost like it doesn't like detail sniping it. Oh boy, um... Navarro would make a good tank for this guy. So I'm going to move Fia back. And Detom's going to stand where she was standing. Uh, no, that's actually a bad idea too. Well, it'll do for a turn. And, uh... Mmm... Mikael would just kind of hide in the corner, would you please? Um, okay, I guess I'll live with this for now. Oh, hey, an attack that does damage. 27 times 3, too much damage. Hmm. Oh, well. Oh god, another Archangel. Hey, Archangel bastard, do you have any idea how much I hate you and your ugly faces and your counterattacks? Ouch. Ah, oh, jeez, that's not cheap at all. You know what, I'm gonna walk up there and smack you. Oh boy, this could take... Hmm. Karin is not going to be useful in this regard. But still, we can see a battle animation. Oh. 
Check it out. <laughs> oh, she's kind of cute. Now that line was just too over the top. Huh. Okay. Here's what we can do. We can stand of all right here. Since he's in range of the guy. Oh, hey, cheap shot. Can I? Hey, that's big. Can I? <laughs> ah. Okay, let's do it again. Shimatsu steru! Totta okiru! Yokeru na yoru! Yeah, if he is hurting, but... It can't use range area of effect attacks back to back, so we should be fine. At least for a while. Ha! Suck it, angel bastard. Um, and Mikhail, keep hiding in the corner. Please? Thank you. Great. Yeah, not much to say here until... Um, well, not much to see at all. Hey, free shots. See? See? It dodged both of them. Stupid bug dodging bat dodge bug bastards. Huh? Oh man. Mm. Shut up, Avaro. So, what happened must be that Dedum's attack paralyzed it. Paralyzed it pretty badly because he's gotten all those double attacks. So, he can only move one square per turn right now. Uh, so Hmm, okay, everything will be fine as is for now. Well, I could keep just capture him right now. Alright, give it a shot, D-Helm. Ha. Huh. Okay. I'm glad that's over. Okay, quit being a bitch, right? And do your damn job. To it, healing. Do some healing. Hmm. Oh, yeah, we're doing that. Not much for Fia to do right at the moment. Well, hell went. Now moved I out of that room, so this ghost has room to move. Probably she'll head straight for Fia and Mikao here. Because she has no sense of self-preservation, obviously. Oh. Now that Kaurin is into determination, into the depths of determination, he might be able to do some damage. Nope, not yet. I 
have a feeling these bugs ran themselves out of spell points. Oh, give me a break. <sighs> I made a mistake. Okay, can't get at you. Am I going to need... Yeah, I'll need an engineer down there, too. And he can take down those bugs pretty well, as well. Hmm. Fatigue potion large. Theo, what are you doing wandering off? Don't you know you're injured? Man, these guys are just intent upon taking you down. Even if it takes them all day. And then some. Perfect! You have fallen into my trap! Hmm, this is troublesome. This is very troublesome. Apparently they have now decided, this one at least, has decided to come after Karin because he's the closest enemy. So let's fix that. Now I'd like to heal you. But I also need to get Fia out of that ghost strange so she'll go after Avaro like she's supposed to. And Avaro, you just stand there. Hmm? Oh! The other ghost is headed for Rudin. There we go. They just keep falling for this strap. Almost there, you. This is great. In my trial run, it took me until turn 32 to get that vortex sealed. And I think we're good with you for now, Karin. Hmm, everything's going well. Oh, jeez. 
Um, too much damage, probably. What's that? 24 times 2. No? No. This will go well. Perfect. Well, as perfect as we can expect under the circumstances. Haha, <laughs> you're probably going to die, clown. Ooh, nice. I mean, I'm still a sucker for attack. Which he didn't get, but that's good enough for now. And now he has a healer backing him up. As well as... Detailm! With, where's his earth bow? There's his earth bow. With an awesome capture. Or not. See if I care. Speaking of awesome captures. Oh yes, healing. Alright, that is all the enemies, and most of the gathering. Now just a little more exploring, and we'll be good. Oh, Detail needs to come and fix that thing up. Interesting. In my trial run, I found that room with Fia, and she said something when she wandered in. Alright, everything's good as far as you're concerned, Mikeu. You too, you. Okay, so this is pretty impressive. From time to time we have such surprising finds like this and that's why Favaro really loves exploration. We don't know who left this behind, but we're going to put it to good use. Hmm, interesting. And of course, when Fia wandered in there by herself, she said something completely different. Maybe everybody in my party, except for my Yuiki and my ghosts, do. The Yuiki are really a mystery. I mean, you'd think they're really important to the plot, but after you capture them, they have nothing to say. You know, in my trial run, I came in here and I'm thinking, Hmm, a treasure room. One of these chests is a mimic. Wait, that's 20 large healing potions. 20 large healing... Well, at least I'm not so low on them anymore. Nice. 
broken dolls. Come to think of it, I haven't gotten and uh, disassembled any of the broken stuff I've found lately. Hmm. Not a hell with strategy, let's just get this over with. Look, it's a mimic. Who's surprised? I'll tell you it wasn't me. Although she is surprisingly cute. I'm gonna take her home with me. Hmm. A gold crown of Inrax. Is that how old this place is? Well, interesting fact. This thing has the seal skill, like Gaidal did. So you can't actually use any special attacks against her. Which makes me sad. Because all of, all of my capture skills are, well, skills. So we can't use it and we can't capture her. Hmm? Now she counterattacked. And that's a special counterattack skill which can inflict instant death. Which I thought would inflict instant death, but I guess it's not a 100%. So anyway, be careful of that when you're fighting this girl. And uh, I guess of basically nothing else because I don't know of any other way it can actually hurt us. Look at that. 37 attack, 37 defense. Join my party, please. Okay, that's enough looking at her. Hey, close up. Nice level up, D-Helm. Hmm. Twin Dolls of the Wind. Great. <laughs> yeah, that's useless. She's got pretty high defense. And since you can't use skills, you basically can't use any magic attacks. So her magic defense doesn't come into play. Oh, and of course, tons of resistances. But she's cute. Anyway. This could take a while. Oh. Everybody stop. We need to do this with someone who can... Someone who has a full mill equipped. Because if we can't capture her, at least we can get double items out of her. And that'll be that for this turn. Do not fight back with Ruben, that's an order. I don't care if it literally kills you. In fact, I would like it if it literally kills you, because I don't like you. Oh, did I say that out loud? Anyway. Full mill time. Great. Sorry, cutie. Wow. And wow. That is so... Yeah. <laughs> hmm. Okay. So. Rainbow. Uh. Find. Thing. That's great and all. The other important thing is I got double drops of the thing it always drops. I think it always just drops this rainbow thing. In any case, that's the whole map. I don't have a gold key. 
And that's all the drops, so let's get out of here. Whoops, this button. <laughs> hmm. In my trial run, I got a bunch of uh, good rocks. Ramias Ishi and even Rien Ishi. And this time it gives me crap. Look! Crystals! I'm already drowning in crystals and it gives me more of them. Oh. I didn't even deploy Kisner, so she didn't get a level up, so that just must be a follow up from the sex scene or whatever. Now, in my trial run, I got the Lamia Sishi and I was able to make the gold key because of it. It'll have to wait this time. Kiss me. Anything new? Oh, jeez. Okay, fine, whatever. Ho oh, ho. Oh. Why not? I could actually use those. Yes. Oh yes, I talked about those broken my uh, broken this and broken that. First, broken hammers. Broken wrenches. I have 17 of them. Yes. Boy, I'm just a collector. Broken bows. Just one. Yes. No broken knives. No broken books. How do you break a book? Ten broken swords. Broken crossbow. Broken dolls. Well, I just got those in a chest. Broken twin shield. Why is there a broken weapon for every one of my characters? Yes. Hmm. Everything except ice I've got some of. Yes. Uh. Well, these ghost girls are popular. Hmm. Oh. Rurin has a ton of choices because we went to an ice themed place and he's an ice themed guy. Still, I'm not going to take too much time thinking about should I do this or should I do that? Hey, double move. Can't wait for it. Males. Hmm. Alright, that'll cover everything. That's all the events, except for Case Nero, and I don't think she's plot important. So I think the next thing to do is to do that... Do the plot construction job. Which involves going way back... Where was it? One of these three places? To find some purple stone. Purple magic ore. In any case, that's coming up next time. As for now, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.